funny thing is, they talked me into this. I, I have to say, I wasn't a big fan of the idea early on because I don't. I, I thought it would probably make us a little bit weaker as a team, total team. But, and I pretty much told them, I said, if you're going to be together, you have to win. I mean, I just, it's a little bit of pressure to put on them. And then when we went to regionals, I mean, we did not play terribly at regionals. Independent played really well, and I felt like I felt like you know, they played. They came a little bit more prepared to play, and we ended up being just a little bit. I don't know, off a step and off our back foot. But I, but as a, the last thing I told them, we got in the car and they pretty much rode home in silence. And in fact, if you look at our regional picture, we won the regional, but not one of them were smiling. I mean, it was kind of like this. And I said, I don't care if you don't smile. I mean, I want you to be, have a little burr under your saddle for all this. And it really, I said, this match doesn't isn't the big match. The next one's the big match. And the, the most amazing thing is, the field we had to go through to win. I mean, we beat a really good Heston team. We beat a really good Kansas City Christian team, and we beat and we we beat soundly a very very good independent team. A team that beat us a week ago. A team that's got a kid on it that's won two championships of his own. So I mean, that's that's an incredibly good win. So I'm very proud of those guys and and validating for Travis. I mean, he's been a great soldier for our team. He's played everywhere we wanted him to play. Played singles for three years, and and you know when he said he'd like to play doubles this year, I said, you know, that's a good thing. You know, you've part of me said it's a good thing. Part of me was thinking, man, I've got guaranteed points with singles and him and Easton, and but you know, Max was Max really played well. I mean, Max was a difference today. Travis played like Travis plays at his best, but Max played the best I've seen him play. What was just so good about it? Well, the the, the funny thing was, I kept telling him. You know, don't lose focus here. And then I thought at one point in time, I said, at the end of the first set, I said, now there's a natural inclination right now to kind of let down a little bit. But I said, I don't think I have to worry about that. I said, I think you guys are so in tune with this match that I don't think I'm going to have to worry about that. But just in case, don't let them off the hook. In the very first game, we had a double break point on Vishnu serve, and they came back and won it. And I, and I said, okay, there's a little worry right here, you know, because we had it and then we don't have it. You've got to stay on top of that. And they were, from that point on, they were nails. I mean, we we really could have won it at 5-1. But they they just played that well. And it's kind of appropriate that, you know, Travis ended the match with his serve and, and with an ace. I mean, that was just, that was awesome. So I'm very pleased with that. Talk about Max, a kid who plays four sports. Well, and... I'm glad you brought that up. <laughs> because, you know, every once in a while, you know, we'll hear this business about, you know, you're, I heard it at our tournament of champions. Well, it's just a... You, the only kids that play on the tennis team are kids who just play tennis. I said, we've got 22 of our 32 kids who play other sports, and Max plays four. He's playing two this spring. He's going to play regional baseball on Monday. Uh, you know, and, and figures his time out to do other stuff. He played basketball this year. He was a kicker on our, on our football team. So, I mean, he's a, he, tennis is probably gets his fourth look, maybe third. And um, you know, very, very pleased with with how he, you know, gives up his time to do it. We hit before school. We can work it in. I mean, because we don't hit with him on days he's going to pitch. And, um, and then some days after he pitches, he doesn't feel like hitting because he's just throwing 100 some pitches and his arm is tired. So, but uh, you know, for three years now he's done this. Every year he's got progressively better. And uh, you know, finished tenth as a sophomore, fifth as a as a junior, and really we're just a couple points away from upsetting the best team in 4A last year. Um, and then this year, you know, just playing so well. It's just really, really good. You know, it's he's, he's just been a joy to coach. And he's the one who early on said, I really want to play with Travis. I go, well, who doesn't want to play with Travis? But, but you know, ultimately, I'm really glad we made that decision. So, Talk about Easton today taking third. Well, you know, that's Easton is Easton's going to be – when it's all said and done, one of our very best players we've ever had. And he ran into two buzz saws today. I mean, it was, Johnny Goodwin is is just a level above everybody else in 3A, and, and a, a level above almost every. I mean, he would have won 4A hands down. He would have won 5A hands down. You know? So he's that good a player. And then Stratton. I mean, Stratton's a good player. You know, Stratton's very strong. And you know. Easton finished third, and you know the natural inclination would have been to let down after he lost that. But I told him, I said, Easton, 
we may need your points if we don't win the doubles to you know to, to break a tie for third. Because I said you know Heston's going to be a dominating. They're, they've got a lot of points on their rackets too, left. So you need to play well. And he went back out there and you know played a little bit. You know it was tough to kind of get the focus back at first. But when he got into gear, he was excellent. The kid he beat is a really good player and beat him badly. So. He's going to be fun to coach for the next three years. And just He's only going to get bigger and stronger and a little bit more sure of himself. He's going to be amazing. So.